Hello wonderful people, hope you're all doing well today. Uh, welcome back to No Man's Sky, we are now on the, I think it's episode 15, my gosh! How the time has just flown by over the last two months. So, uh, welcome, welcome. Uh, you may have noticed I actually named this episode. Uh, today I actually want to try and focus on the Sentinel quest line. We have got this one been sitting in here in a while, and I would like to try and get this one cleared off as soon as possible. Where are we? It is Trace of Metal. Uh, field test the drone that you found in the Sentinel. Um, we're going to try that one out, and then we're going to carry on see what happens. A few things have changed since the last time. Um, I did find a better capital ship. Um, and I uh, managed to get it. Not an S-Class, but this one had better stats. And... If I can... It's under appearance, isn't it? I bet it's under appearance. But this one is... Uh, guess my appearance? A Star Destroyer. Which I think looks amazing. Absolutely amazing. I actually wanted the gold uh, back here. So yeah, uh, we'll have that one. I'm finally awake for a hop stream. Hello, Sven. Hope you're doing well. But, uh, yeah. Uh, we also have moved the uh, systems for the community base. So, as time goes on, we will be uh, moving people over here. At the moment, only two of us have moved across, but we should, hopefully, be grabbing more. If I quickly boot up the system we found, we have found a five-planet, one-moon system. We have two, um, what are they called? Paradise Planets. We have New CX and uh, New Friendo, called New Friendo after the Friends and Fiendos. Hello, Ari. It's nice to see you up today. Uh, we then have three major planets. We have this one, which is a fungal uh, planet, fungal acidic planet. So, uh, wonder who might want to move there. That's one of my friends. Uh, we got this one here, which is a windswept planet. And we got this one here, which is, of course, a gamma intensified planet meaning all three of those have different things like uranium this one here is copper and pyrite this one here is fungal copper and, and ammonia basically it's going to set us up so we have some really nice bases there's also a moon orbiting the middle one which has silver as a possibility so hopefully at some point i'll be setting up silver farms etc 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 but I digress. I do want to head over to um, start this quest line. I... Why can't I... That was weird. It wouldn't let me access the front of my teleporter. Uh, where are we? I will probably be deleting this base and possibly my starter base. I really enjoyed these ones, but we've completely moved system, which has been nice. Uh, I'm assuming the fact that there is no marker up for teleportation. I can do this from any... Oh! Oh, thank you very much for the uh, three months uh, sub, Harry. That's very kind of you. And the current two-month streak. You really didn't have to. <laughs> I just uh, appreciate the uh, company more than anything else. We are going to try and launch this. Hmm. I'm a bit worried this is going to start a Sentinel quest. I'm going to head over to... Hobbs's outpost in the Euclid. This is where we're setting up in the Euclid galaxy. Basically, where we've now set up isn't in Euclid. So we're going to have a little assessment in Euclid, and we've got the main base, which is in. What's this? I think it's Aaron. Aerith? I have to double check. But it's a different part of the universe, or galaxy, or in more to be apt, reality. So uh, it'll be fun when we get there. But I'm going to go back to Euclid quickly. And I'm going to try launching this little guy. Hear my music starting up. I don't know why it does this. Sometimes the teleporter throws you out underneath the base. So if you do end up building up, what I strongly suggest you do what I do. Just hide doors. So if anyone does come get trapped down here. There's a door over here which takes you out. And there's a door over here which get, uh, takes you out, because um, I don't want people getting trapped under my base. See, there are two doors. I even made this a bit flat to try and stop the earth growing down, but I put two up weights out in case people get stuck. But yeah, we haven't been here for a while. This is, of course, the uh, 
base we made last time. Right, now I'm assuming I prob... That's a very interesting looking bird. Uh, I'm assuming I'm going to want to get away from the base. I just have this really horrible feeling that I'm going to have Sentinel's attack. And if I'm going to get Sentinel's attack, I don't really want to be near the base. So if we can... Uh... Oh my goodness. Why are you not accelerating? I need to get better stuff on here. That's better. Try the pedal on the right. Well, I wish there was a pedal on the right, but if I go into first person, he says, is it in first person? I thought there was a first person. Oh, maybe not. Oh, there literally is no first person. I thought there was. Uh, it's just an orb with levers. Okay. I kind of feel like that's, that's a pretty safe distance, just in case, you know, it hits the fan. There you go. We're going to field test this guy. Hitting tab. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Hi, little dude. Excuse me. Deatomize you. Hi, little dude. How are you doing? Uh, fault detected. Reverting. Core congestion function available. High presence disabled. Fix of glass, 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 glass. Input required. Select restart. Hmm. Let's do fragment it so we can work. Access denied. Okay. Look at update. Sentinel pillar no detected. Coordinates. Download coordinates. I mean, okay. He said he wanted glass. Let's call in the freighter because I'm pretty sure I actually have got. Boom. Because that's not menacing. I deliberately picked this one, which I've named the Raphophilia. Because this one here is actually the smallest of the Star, of the star Destroyers you can get. And, uh, you know, small and angry. Okay, buddy. You want me to... Glass. Okay, do I have any glass I can bring down? Oh, there you go. Nice little outline of the ship. Do I have any glass in here? Please do not judge me on management. I do need to sort it out more. Actually, I think I might actually have some in my... I do have some in my exosuit. Can I not just give that to him? There he is. Well, as we go to a sentinel pillar, so let's uh, lock and load. I may have deliberately picked this uh, area because I knew there was a sentinel pillar nearby. In fact, I believe it's over here. Just over there. I've got that one here, get a little bit of language. Where is he? Did he? Did he? He's over here. I'm assuming, buddy, you want me to attack that sentinel pillar, which is a doable thing. Let's make sure we get out the right gun. Let's call in Bumblebee to give us a sec. I need a better name than Bumblebee. I called it Bumblebee because I was like, yeah, it kind of reminds me of Bumblebee from Transformers. It is that one. Buddha. I mean, it looks a bit like a bumblebee. It's even got a little smiley face, see? Just there. Did I turn off AI? I turned off AI, didn't I? Enable AI module. Hey, dude. I'm going to need your help. So, I'm assuming you want me to attack the Sentinel base. I just have that feeling. Buddy... Before I do something reckless, locate the sensor base nearby. Try using the F with the visor. Okay. Oh, look. You wanted me to find that building I was standing right in front of. Located. Target objective. I'm assuming. Yep, you want me to attack. Oh, you're going to want me to attack it, aren't you?
Yep, I'm going to have to blow up the sides. Okay, we'll do this. Uh, hello. Let's, uh, get on the correct gun. I can get Bumblebee to, uh, you know, draw some fire for me. Good boy. Reload, reload, reload! Let's blow off that armor. Oh, I need an upgrade so I can get armor like that. That'd be amazing if I could upload that. Guards remaining, one. Where is he? Nope, that's the one I, I made. Sorry, saved, not made. Can I access you now? Let's see what we got. Sentinel hard frame. Oh! Oh <gasps> no! Is that armor? Uh, the terminal attempts to broadcast the data in the Sentinel, but it is wrong. It hears a voice the excess. Sentinel attempts to. No way! Um. What I need silica powder, which I don't think I've got any on me. Oh, wow! My Sentinel got really banged up in that fight. Uh, silica powder. I think I've got some in here. Because I was making glass earlier today. That's why I uh, happen to have some. So if I can quickly fix the silica powder. Where is this? Hello. What are you? Sentinel hard frame right arm. Ooh. Uh, a collection of salvaged... Da -da -da. Ooh! Oh, his helm went blue! Is that like a flamethrower? That's really cool! Can I, uh... It's like a lightning bolt thing? That's very cool. Um, that was actually really fun. Uh, at least I answered that question. Lizard boy gonna get Stonky? I'm assuming you mean the thing that ran up to me like uh, deatomized. Uh, yes, my editor, yes. Affinity good. The settlements are frag. Settlers are fragmented. See them? Come with you? Return to your settlement. I wonder if I can paint it or if it's stuck blue. I guess if it is a sentinel um, armor piece, they are traditionally blue. How far away am I? I have to admit, it's really weird seeing a gun for a right arm. I'm used to, you know, having two hands for my Sentinel. Not Sentinel, drone. Not drone, mech. Wow, words today. Words are indeed very hard. Uh, 
Alright, where did you want me to head to, buddy? You said you needed me to head somewhere. You want me to head here. Oh, I wasn't going to show this yet. Is this the one on New CX? I bet you it is. So I moved my settlement. I thought with the paradise planets that we're building on, I might as well. Yeah, we're on New CX. God damn it. Uh, I've got a settlement on New CX, and I built the capital on uh, New Fiendo. So, um. I was hoping to get this past stage one, because <laughs> I'm on stage one at the moment of literally just claimed this place. Although, uh, unlike, for instance, the old place, by view status, this started as a B-class settlement. I need to rename this. Um, it was New CX. Um, what should I call this? I need a name for this town. Uh, it's a wine distiller distillery area because their primary thing is wines. Hmm. Okay. Let's see. Famous wine places. Maybe somewhere in UK ish? Let's see. Somewhere fun. Uh. Ha mm. I think maybe New Hampshire. You saw that. <laughs> um, Billy, ignore that. That was a typo. Uh, except, yeah, let's go for New Hampshire. Beep boop, beep boop. Uh, here we go. Uh, sisters have grown curious. They note the sudden traumatic appearance of a sentinel's hard fray. And the overseer appears to be accompanied by the rough drone. Demand of these things. I'm going for reassuring. I'm going to reassure them. Uh, the citizens are pleased by your words. They have lived in fear of the sentinels their entire lives. And now hope for peace. They wish to assist you in your search for answers. And have prepared an expedition. Let's send to a monolith. Do I... The away team searches for a monolith for close of the sentinel process. Do I have to wait for them to come back? That's the big question. Sentinel broadcast detected. Sentinel very weak. Over there. Or is that you, buddy? You're over there. Can I speak to you? Uh, vo, vo, Vosilus bad. Help me, you. Go there. Go to this place. Accept data coordinates. Uh, the drone transmates a set of numbers to my exosuit. They do appear to be valid coordinates. Now the question is, is it taking me... Hello Mark, you hope you're doing well. Uh, I wonder if this is going to take me back to Euclid or keep me where I am. That is the big question. Uh, let's see. Mission target is in another system in space. Consult your galaxy map with X. Okay, I might need to head into space and see if it is in here. I have a feeling it's sending me back to Euclid. So, um, yeah, this is uh, Hampshire now. Um, this is a set city, uh, well, a settlement I've just picked up this morning, actually. Uh, and I've started building a spaceport over here. It's very early day. Uh, you're doing well? How am I? I'm doing so much better today. Thank you so much for asking. Uh, 
So, uh, New Hampshire. Um, I've given it a uh, New Siak spaceport, which is over here, though I might change it to Hampshire spaceport. I've gone for a... Again, I only did this this morning, so I barely had time to build this up. I think maybe an hour, if that. Uh, if I can remember how to get into fly mode. So I've gone for a uh, surprise to fries, if you've been following me on Twitter. Uh, I've gone for a spherical build, <laughs> which is funny because I've been doing so much in sphericals recently, with multiple different spaceport landing places. Because we're in a high enriched area, there is a higher chance of us getting a S-Class building. I've put in true trade terminals either side of the landing bay, here and here. I've gone for a circular um, pattern design, which I've had a chunk bitten out of it, just for a bit of um, change of scenery. Uh, I've gone for a spherical half circle, like this. It does have a little bit of overlap over there, but you barely notice it from the ground. And it really does bring that curve nicely. I had to free place these points because if you remember my episode one when i tried building with half walls half walls are a bloody pain to build with and i freaking hate them uh -huh. and then in here i literally just put down a teleporter and a staircase up and this area i barely got anything but this is pretty much my um small little outpost here because there's no point building here, because of course I'm building the capital city, which again is oh so... Ooh, little lizard guys, can I scan you? Oh, I'm not on my scanner. Can I scan you? No, I've already scanned you before. Uh, which, as I mentioned previously, is um, where I moved. Now, I did... I've tried to... This is going to surprise you. I've done a little bit of organisation. So if I go into multi-tools, my one is an S-Class uh, scanner multi-tool, which literally just has scanning stuff. I've got a solar ray, I've got a manipulator, I've got a deatomizer, um, basic mining material, advanced mining material. I've got a stealth cloak so that I can go invisible. Then my number one slot, I've got a... Uh, semi-automatic gun which i'm still working on is literally just a bolt caster but this one has the should have the shield mog augment the shield mog augment's not working that should have been right click and ga gain the shield i don't know about that uh my free is the alien weapon i got which again is not it was one of the free twitch drops from when I did the Twitch event. So I kind of kept it. Uh, and my four, of course, is the other one from the Twitch event, which is the Blazer. And I think my five is... Nope. It's just those four. I thought I had a five. But yeah, I'm trying to organise it so I can try and... Oh, thank you very much for the... Hey, um, Mofu Giddy, how are you doing? Uh, stretch and hydrate. Give me a second. I will stretch and hydrate for you. Oh. But yeah, I am desperately, desperately trying to... Because you only have a limited amount of space for tools. And I keep hitting the right, wrong bottom. Uh, button. <laughs> wrong bottom. Wrong button. Uh, you have limited space and you want to try and box things. Because if you box them, you get bonuses. Hence why you've got green lights over here. And you've got gold lights over here. They get bonuses. If I, for instance, move this one away, that doesn't get a bonus anymore. And they still stay bonus. You want to box them. I am basically turning this multi-tool into a scanning rage really far and being able to gain additional things. <laughs> uh, kitty pick. Um, how are you doing, Mark? And I'm doing well. Uh, trying to decide whether I'm trying to KFC. I love KFC. KFC is gorgeous. <laughs> I don't tell my friend that thing. Right, whereabouts did my ship park? It's apparently parked over here. I would have thought it would have gone to that landing pad. Whereabouts is... Wait a minute. It landed in the middle of here. Why did it man land in the middle of this one? I'll have a quick look. Oh, man. Let's bring in my uh, big ship a second, because apparently I need a resource. Do I... 
I have no idea. Oh, because I'm constructing a landing pad here, apparently. It's half constructed. <laughs> right, we're going to head up into space, and we're going to see if it's in this system or if it's in Euclid. I have a feeling it's in Euclid. See, if we do a little flyby, I'll show off the uh, fleet while it's here. Uh, camera mode. So we got the uh, Wrath of Philia over here, which is a Star Destroyer type based one. Uh, and we've got all our individual freighters, trade ship, fighters, and then we got this beauty who is right there. Let me try and move the sun because I'm in summer. Look at that. Oh, she's gorgeous. This is my uh, living freighter. I, uh, I desperately need to try and get another one. It's another reason why I wanted to jump reality to try and find another. But yeah, it's a live ship. So gorgeous. <laughs> right, now I'm in this high enough in the air. Let's see if I can hit the map system. Are you... Oh, you literally are the next system. So it did move realities with me. That made life so much easier. <laughs> uh, what well, is cheaper than to go collect it? Getting out the house at the Oh, man, I really want KFC now. I'm meant to be going out with uh, taking Philia to one of the uh, car... Uh, well, it's not the castle I work in, one of our sister castles today. Might see if we can drop by KFC on the way home. <laughs> right, high temperature planet. You want me to go... where are we? You want me to head over here? It's nice this is all undiscovered, which means that... See, we went to a popular system. We're in galaxy number 15, I think. And we did about five or six jumps in a random direction, hoping we wouldn't bump into anyone. And that's pretty much what we did. Oh! Hello. Hello there. I wasn't expecting this. Uh, it should be. It should be another egg, another void egg. May you hatch the void egg. Might as well start this one up. A set of coordinates have been bleeped onto your navigation computer. We will pick that up later. But it's nice that's fallen up. For those of you who did not know, um, what happened was I was I got a void egg, and we started the quest line for the void egg. Where's the Sentinel quest line? I want to finish the Sentinel one. We started the mission for the Void Egg. Then I was doing a weekend mission with a couple of new players. And what happened was... Um, my... Uh, I died. And when I died, the uh, game also kicked me out of um, the actual game. Which then meant I lost all my inventory. Which meant I lost my original Void Egg. So if you watched episode, I think, four or five, when I did the Void Egg, um, I ended up losing said Void Egg. Now, I, I am part of a group, which are really lovely guys. I put up a very distressed post saying how annoyed I was I lost my Void Egg uh, due to a, basically a bug. I got given, if I go into my exosuit, uh, a replacement and of course the one that just hatched so I've got two replacement eggs so I'm hoping to get that on screen on a playthrough now the void egg will take us a very long time because of course it takes a week to get them <laughs> boops a kitty ah oh, I need to get a boop I've been very tempted to try and get a interactive thing with some more things but it's not the same when you're a PNG YouTuber than a oh my god it looks like a tiny dodo oh it's so cute where is it uh, it's not the same when you are a tiny VTuber rather than a three dimensional person like Philia is where the hell did that thing go
that's a cute little thing. Look at that. Let's have a look at you. Can I... Don't run away. Uh, oh, do I not have any pellets on me? Hey, buddy, 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 buddy. Don't run. Don't run. Hey. Let's have a look at you. You're cute. You're like a, a little two-legged chicken thing. It's them big guys. I, I used to have one of those, but I got rid of it. Sadly, I needed space because uh, I was advised to keep a space slot opened on this mission. And after having the flying guy follow me around the Sentinel, I think I know why people advised me to. Uh, uh, Cindy has some headpats and some slam gifts. Ooh, that sounds cool. I uh, could be convinced to make you a 3D one hob so that, that I can get you fix you up, but you need to buy yourself a good camera though. Ah! I've got that on I've got that on tape now. I might have to look for a good camera then. It'd be kind of fun. It'd be nice to have you guys interact. Uh, I kinda need that thesis. Sorry dude. Can I uh, can I pick that up? Right. A sentinel building is under construction with this. Use the station teleporter to return. Headpads for hot. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> Where am I up to? Let's use the teleport. Hang on. What am I doing wrong? Hit P. Settlement status can be seen throughout the. Assign the local population to. I will maintain the system. I could have sworn it told me to go back, back here. Headpads. I would love it if I could get an animation for headpads. That would be cool. Philia has a headpad animation. And I head to the space station. So I can get the space station unlocked. I might need to jump system and jump back. Because for some reason it's not. Because it triggered the the egg quest line. Which I'm kind of excited about. Um, I get up and give him IRL head pads. Oh thank you Philia. Thank you for the head pads. <laughs> so yeah it's, it seems that I need to you know. Hey, Philia, that when people redeem headpats, she has to come up and give me a headpat. I don't think she likes that deal. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Use the space station teleporter to return to your settlement for progress. So I've flown here, and now it's telling me to go back to literally where I was. I see. <laughs> okay, well, I mean, it got out for a walk, I guess. Good, good for it. I'm hoping this put put... Uh, carries on nicely. Okay, here we go. You want me to head over here. You want me to use this terminal? I'm assuming? Do you not? Uh, assemble materials for the docking area. You need to find Aaron. Aaron? Ar this. I feel like it's dragged me to the wrong quest. Hang on. I have, because I hit the wrong quest. Ugh. I hit the wrong button. So sad. Yep, that's why I didn't show up and why it told me to head back here. I clicked on the mission to carry on 
the quest here, not the quest to, you know, carry on with uh, the Sentinel. Take two. <laughs> Proximity of ship. And let me guess, jump back to the system I literally was in? Yep. Boom. So, yeah, we're in Galaxy 15, I believe. We actually found a wonderful, wonderful place to set up. Um, I managed to name two of the planets. Uh, as far as I'm aware, no one's been in the surrounding area, but we are actually quite close to other players, so we might bump into a couple. Heading to the correct planet, take two. 25 seconds. I can do that in 25 seconds. High silver planet. I do need to set up more farms. Oh yeah, there are farms set up for the community. I've set up an oxygen farm and a ferrite farm and a magnetized ferrite farm and a, uh, what's it called? Chromatic metal farm. Need to set up a sodium farm and a silver farm. Dear God, do we need sodium and silver? There's two things that have really been screwing us over recently. <laughs> Eight, seven, six. I'm assuming I'm going to have to fight another sentinel tower. And if I'm going to have to fight another... Maybe when we go in here? Doesn't look like a sentinel tower. On the off chance it is here, I'm gonna use this land. Yeah, it's here. What do we have here? This looks like a sentinel outpost. This is a sentinel outpost. Okay. Uh, if that's the case, I'm gonna bring in my freighter, uh, my capital ship, so I can bring in my drone for cover fire. Yep, reinforced door, fort so would help if I use the correct gun. I might have to rename him because he can't be called Bumblebee if he's stuck blue. Um, Facility Outpost, Procedure Pause, Waiting Modification. Uh, here we go. By the number of the scrolls passing calling out to me, I hand my I find my hands upon the panel. A needle extends from my gloves to my suit. I need to know if I have the needle in my suit. I do not move. Give in. I extend my exosuit. I am a status powerless witness of whatever is attempting. Uh, wave after wave of numbers for my terminal screen, swirling as the exosuit finds data. Okay. Glove archive breach. Bondage status open. Download. Yes. So see through the window. The accessory hard frame beneath. Nice! The other arm! Oh, this is going a lot quicker than I thought it was. I actually thought this might have been like another this takes a week to do jobby. Um attempted registration of the drone unit transmit upgrade pack broadcast the upgrade pack to you nice uh, we need to get out of here very quickly but first as we've broken in here might as well you know loot the place oh my sentinel deactivated them I'm happy with that. Um, right. Uh, let's see if we can... Yes. Did I not... Ha! <laughs> nice. Right arm and left arm installed. Ooh, I might have to try and sort this out a bit more. So it looks a bit more neater. So I'll have the right and left arm there. I've got all the guns here in a nice little brick pattern. I've got the different engines here. Yeah. Uh, the AI... 
I'll put the AI project there. I'll do the scanner array there. I'll put that there. I'll put the fuel injector. Uh, let's, let's move those two around. And I'll put the defensive one there. This is turning very much into a battle suit rather than a material gatherer. I might have to keep that in mind. Uh, hey, buddy. Where do you want me to head to next? Uh, I have never had a name before. Laylapse is happy. I'm hoping I get to keep the Sentinel. That'd be amazing. Okay. Do you tell me where I'm meant to head next? Debrief the away team. Ah! Uh, go back to the away team then. Maybe they're back. With any luck. Uh, he says what was returned from the Sentinel mission. Address the away team. We'll, we'll walk back from the uh, Wrath of Philia. We uh, we originally called my uh, first ship the Little Philia because it was the smallest cargo vessel you could get. And then I got the freaking Star Destroyer, which happens to be the smallest of the Star Destroyers. So I thought I'd keep the name changed and have it the Wrath of Philia. <laughs> um. Where are we? We'll head to my teleportation area. I had a friend come in here yesterday and they got lost in my uh, ship. I'm still under construction. But just to let you know, we've got sections up here. This goes all the way to the back. We've got cargo holes. We've got operations. Loads of grass um, building areas for uh, Gecknip. Engineering's over here. And then it goes, as you can see, all the way to the very back wall there, which I'm going to be building more walls. You can come upstairs. Where you've got, all the way down here, we've got additional rooms. Haven't done much. The one areas I have started doing is in here. These are going to be crew quarters. So, all of these have got beds for crew. I'm going to build another one from the other side. Over here is going to be another farm. This is going to be four different resources. Over here, we have a nightclub type 10-4 um, rest area. And then over here, I've got my uh, canteen kitchen. Where we do cooking, and I'm going to turn this into a grass area as well for different things. So I am slowly trying to make it look more and more like a ship. That's a living ship, rather than... Oh yeah, and it goes one more floor up, then one more floor up again, but I've barely touched the additional floors. Technically, I didn't even need to go this high, but I really want to make this into a whole moving and operational base. So if we go to the teleporter, take me back to settlement. Oh, I never checked for the trade terminal here before moving. Oh well. Over here. Uh, have a look at the Sentinel thing. The citizens who went to seek out answers to the Sentinel have returned from their expedition. They report they have found Sentinel its hard frame blueprints, but have the atmosphere is subdued. I think them.
Additional feature creepy spreading glass. Quarantine. The citizens murmur their appreciation, but there was a murmuring, swelling rumor about the water. The citizens are reluctant to speak further. I'm going to go for quarantine them. Because I just have this really bad feeling that I'm, they're going to bring an illness into my group thing. View settlement. And everything's still positive. Which is pretty good. Uh, where are we? Oh. Hey, buddy. Let's see if I can install. I can. Nice. Hmm. Yeah, this is taking a lot more room than I was originally intending. And it really clashes the yellow with the uh, blue. I might need to repaint this, which would be an absolute shame, but... Let's see, can you, do you get like a bonus? Oh wow, you can jump higher. And you seem to be more armoured. Uh, the Sentinel has broadcast a series proceed to the planetary service and deploy the Sentinel. Okay. Hey buddy, what's up? I'm thinking about names. Telemon, not Telemon. Place names. People have names. Even clothing has names. But I do not possess a name. Why? Say that drones are drones. Say they don't need one. Say you don't know. I'm going to say I don't know. Uh, when I was a part of the hive, I did not require a designation. But where is my hive now? I know. I will give myself a name. I will call myself Laylapse. That is a good name, is it not? Say hello, Laylapse. Lights flash around Laylapse's carapace. <laughs> they are delighted to hear their name. Your Minotaur friend needs a mind before it has flourished. I can help. I can help. I see a big walkers. I see them walk. Obtain the brain of a walker. See the anomaly and bring see the anomaly and bring them to them. Ha ha ha! I've got a walker brain because I have been killing sentinels because uh, there was a sentinel on our last planet and uh, I tried to get rid of them. Are you going to let me... Because I have a sentinel brain. Are you going to let me move my sentinel brain? Or do I have to actually go and do a fight? You're going to make me do the fight, aren't you? Where's my ship? It's over there. Oh, I know why. Because I never brought in the... Um, freighter. I have sentinel brains. Where are my sentinel brains? Philia, I know you're going to say you should organize your ship before stream. Philia, I know you're going to be saying that if I organized my ship, I would find the sentinel brains quicker. Philia, I can feel the judgment in your head. Walk around sounds remarkably terrifying. Then you should organize your ship before stream. God damn it! <laughs> I could have sworn I had a walker brain. Perhaps not. Perhaps I did not have a walker brain. Perhaps I should look at trying to get myself a walker brain by just following the quest line. Let's just follow the quest line. 
Right, let's get ourselves a walker brain. Uh, you know if you had, you would have found it quicker. You're so mean. You're right, but you're so mean. Walker low question? Question mark face? Yeah, I knew it was going to be on this planet. It's on the moon, which is full of sentinels. Install a paralyze module from a walker for walker combat? Oh. Apparently, I need a paralyze module. Okay. Uh, do I have one? I do. Do I have any bonuses for it? Um, do I have any bonuses for it? I don't seem to have bonuses for it. You're a bolt caster, A class thing. I have a feeling if I install you, you're going to have a go at me because you can only have so many. Oh no, I can install you. Can I install another one? I'm trying to work out how many of these bolt caster things can I install? Or is that going to be too many? No, I can do that one as well. Wow, that's really increasing my damage output for the uh, bolter. I thought I could only have four. Um, do I have any other bolts of things I could do? I do, however, have one of these, which is the, for that, I believe. I believe it's for that. So I can opt for this weapon they need me to use. Or is that for the plasma launcher? I hate how uh, similar some of these stuff are. Oh, screw it, if the shield's not working, let's just go for a, uh, hang on. Apologies for that. Let's throw an advanced mining laser as well. Just to be on the safe side, just in case I need an advanced mining laser. I doubt I need one, but... I just have that... F Do you know what? You have that feeling where you're going to go up against something you really don't want to fight. But you just have that feeling that it's going to be a hard fight. I'm having that. Around those as well, just in case. Just in case. I'm hoping this fight's going to go well, because I hate fighting walkers. And we'll just throw that in, just for the be on the safe side. Cool. Let's roll. Okay, mission started. Targets. Huh? Why is it showing you the perch? I don't want the perch. Has it changed my mission? I changed my mission. I don't want the perch. I want this one. Where is this thing taking me? Is it directly below? I need to find a walker brain. I'm assuming it's that. In fact, I haven't even landed and I'm hearing combat music. I definitely think it's that. Yep, that is indeed a walker. This is just the one. 
Welcome to uh, dealing with walkers. They're not too bad to fight. The trick is you need to knock off all their armor first. The sad thing is they have a lot of armor. They also generally come in with these things, which are repair drones. They generally show up when you get to level 5 um, danger. I know it's spawned at a level 3 danger area. But, um, yeah, surprisingly this is a lot easier than I was expecting it to be. Because normally I have to contend with these and two of the uh, mechs like mine, as well as um, flyers, uh, spawners and repair, because the higher danger level. Come on, Bumblebee, get the cover fire. The walker's looking at me while Bumblebee's doing damage. I'm happy with this. As long as it just doesn't... There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Where is that piece? There's another drone. That was a summoner. They would have summoned more in. I think that was the brain, but just in case. Walk brain. Here we go! Pristine brain! Uh, shifting neurons, clicking together with the pure fragments. Unlike most walker brains, this one has survived a violent experience of the prison site and undamaged. It could be very vital with your new. Excellent! So it would appear... Can I uh, take advantage of this as well? Uh, seek out the ones you find. Just while I'm here, I mean, you don't often find these. Historical data retrieval. Oh, I'll sort that out later. I was hoping that was going to be showing me where the Stargate is. Because uh, I could really do with the Stargate. Where do you need me to go? Was the anomaly? Where did I park my ship? There it is. Oh, hang on. Oh, cool. I actually got another Walker Brain part. I'm happy with that. <laughs> Mushrooms, they look like. That's pretty cool. <laughs> uh, let's get out of this planet. So we need to head to... Let's see. We need to summon in the anomaly. I'm assuming there's someone in the anomaly we have to speak to. and I'm assuming it's the chameleon guy who started this quest all the way back in like episode 5 or 6. They're little frogs on mushrooms. Oh, that's kind of cool. Uh, good old anomaly. I love the anomaly. It's where you generally meet the hustle and bustle of other players. That reminds me. Freighter while I'm here. Uh, exosuit. 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 Oh, I, did, I didn't have much on me today. That'll do. Right, let's uh, let's do some uh, handouts for uh, some players who might need new uh, help with uh, getting set up. Uh, there you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. There you go, buddy. 
Someone very kindly helped me on my first day in No Man's Sky, so I've been trying to return the favour. Let's send that to you. A guy I don't have much, but that will sell for a bit. As it turns into metal, and I've got a pretty good farm that produces it. Um, yeah, I actually do have the title uh, "The Generous" because I've given away so much stuff to players in game. That's how you get the title. But I've, I've kept it up because um, if someone was kind enough to help me on when I first started, you know. Fly second day. Uh, still alive, I see. That is a good start. Uh, they is doing their best to appreciate aloof and unconcerned, but it is clear to me they are struggling to contain their excitement. Before I can reply, uh, they explode with questions. Did it work, Traveller? Tell me, did the drone live? Where has it led you? What well, have you learned? Say the drone is doing well. Say the drone gave itself a name. Let's do. Let's start with that. That's the important one. A name? It gave itself a name? Hmm. That is unusual. That is beyond the simple engineering. I should have a look more closely at the beads Polo gave you. Uh, so the Gek is always up to something. Say the drone is doing well. Uh, excellent. Uh, we have done well. Done well indeed. Oh, I do wish I could see it, but it cannot le uh, leave this anomaly. And this anomaly is the one place a drone can never be. Reveal the pristine brain. I've seen a lot of things in my life, Traveller, but not one so beautiful. And uh, you say the drone friend told you to bring this to me? Remarkable. So we want this to go into a minotaur. I like um, I like how you think, Traveller. Bring the heavy armament to the fight against the Sentinels. There are a few vulnerable uh, valuables vulnerables in these things. Sorry, let's try again. There are a few vulnerabilities in this thing. Should be a simple enough job to bypass a few circuitry. Yes. This won't take long. Uh, there. Done. I've done the hard part uh, for you. And rewired the brain. The schematics should take you through the rest of the progress. Nice. Radium. How the hell do I get a radium brain? But Traveller. This, uh, this brain... It won't come close enough to something else, something crimson. I don't... well... Look, you'll find out soon enough. The signature I've encoded in the brain will draw its attention. Head out into space, you'll know what to do. I have a feeling I have to go into pulse drive. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I've gotten help with those when you can. And the Twitch app is being a little stupid, like always. Uh, oh, um, I need to... Thank you for letting me see that. I need to uh, kick that out of chat. Give me a second. Thank you, Philia. Can you get a block and a ban? Uh, thank you, Philia. Oh, I hate it when they jump in with their random by viewers. It's terrible. Uh, farewell, Traveller. Especially in the middle of a dramatic reading. How rude. They could have at least waited till I finished reading. And then done it. Thank you for bringing that to my um, attention, Mofu. Right. I need to go into deep space. which means I need to go back into my ship which is over here but it's not showing up which means someone has glitched in here which is why there's a ship up there the advertising so well I didn't even notice same I it slipped my mind I didn't notice it uh, I need to go into fly into space present to the crimson void I'm guessing I need to go into a red sector. 
which luckily enough we are next to a red sector. I'm assuming now we're in a red sector uh, I need to just go into deep uh, deep space now I'm in the red sector and I'm assuming I just pulse till something comes out uh, oh, that was quick uh, normally detected. That's a Atlas thing. Hello, Atlas project. The Atlas beacon drifts through space. Impos impossible silence loudly. It knows I'm here. Present the hacker brain. Gepton as sin endless relaxant subwajuga is rakas. Uh, basically, face roll key keyboard. Uh, again, face roll and keyboard. A uh, rare item has been found. I think that's the last item I need. But of course, I can't install it from here. I d Messenger from Atlas. Can I... Nope. <laughs> Let's let's see. Oh, what's this? Out of interest, what do we got here? Ooh, there's some really good resources on that place. There's only a drop away. Okay. So we need to head back to where we are. Land, install that piece, and then I think that might be the end of the quest. Unless there's a little more to go. Oh crap, pirates. Get out my sector. This is not your space. <clears throat> Don't you know Disney told us that only um, all good pirates uh, never steal without asking permission first? You didn't ask permission. I don't like how close that is. And where's this last piece? Stop there. Oh, I clipped it, didn't I? Oh, son of a bitch. So now that means I have to deal with Sentinels and the Pirates. And I'm not going to get a reward because I accidentally clipped the big ship. Why is my ship not landing? Uh, hello, No Man's Guy. You should not be able to let me jump into. Uh, hello. That should not have been able to happen. I flew into the hangar bay without actually flying into the hangar bay. Huh? Why are the uh, the net systems not enabling? The 
they should have enabled. Let's try again. Screw it, we're going to fly to here and then go back. Not the crap pirates I hear you steal from since. They are getting sneaky. Yes, they are. Okay, let's see. Let's head back out and actually see if I can interact with that ship. I don't know what the hell happened there. I think because I clipped it, as in I accidentally shot it aside, it closed off its entrance thing, but it hadn't updated because it had acknowledged I finished the quest line for saving it. So for some reason it was knocking me in and out. Let's see if I can board it now. There you go. That's what should have happened. Literally, that's what should have happened. The only reason I'm boarding it is on the off chance it's an S class. If it's not an S class, I'm not interested. I actually like my uh, ship I've got. What are you? What are you? You don't have a visual. You are a A class. I'll compare you to mine, but I already know mine's better because uh, it looks like a Star Destroyer. This is my favourite of like design of the two, uh, but I actually prefer the. I went for the Star Destroyer just for the, the funniness of it. Uh, let's have a look at your fit, your ship. I mean, I love this sleek design. Um, I'm going to compare it to mine. I, I bet you mine is pretty much yeah. 30, it's got more slots by one. That's pretty much it. That's the only difference is it gets one extra slot, and they're, they're answering quite a bit. If this was an S-Class, I would have been all over this. The hyperdrive range, the only reason it's so high is... Oh, actually, no, I've got a higher hyperdrive range. That's weird. But no, I, I would love to get an S-Class. I don't think you can actually upgrade these to higher classes. If they could, I'd keep my one and make it an S-Class. Uh, hey, it looks like I've been playing a space game in the future. So, it looks like you'll be playing space games in the future. Oh! Have I twisted your arm into playing New Man's Sky? That would be amazing. Right, I need to land on a planet. Which planet do I land on? I'll just head straight down to New CX. I do enjoy space games. They've been fun. It's nice to break away from just playing fantasy. But um. Okay, here we go. Installed Sentinel Park. One, two, three, boom. Hey, looks like Sentinel's fully upgraded. This has been damaged in the last fight. Nice. Is that the end of the quest line? Bumblebee needs a new name. Bumblebee really needs a new variant. I can't call it Bumblebee being bright blue. Uh, we will be a good team, all of us and you. And the big Minotaur friend. Is that the end of the quest? Uh, Leyline is delighted by the transformation of the Minotaur. The Minotaur is not a robotic machine anymore. It is a friend or not friend. They can choose. I'm so glad you agreed to help uh, now what's not Telemon. Uh, 
Ask who Telamon is. Leylaps is amused at the concern. Of course you don't know, do you? Well, it does not matter. I am a glad we are friends. Likes ch uh, chitter against the Leylap shielding and Hestian halting patterns. They attempt to be considering something of importance. I have uh, proven we are friends. Erase me from the pillar records. Attack the hive. Attack the sentinels with my blessing. Ooh, we are a team. It seems like he wants me to attack the sentinels, but why would he want to do that? Will you? Okay, I got some navigational data. Whereabouts do you want to send me, buddy? Feel like the Sentinel's gone. Uh, the uh, Minotaur's gotten a lot bigger. Where are you sending me? Ah, over here. Which planet's this? Oh, cool. That's the moon I don't like going to because it's full of Sentinels. It's the only place that has Sentinels in the system. to land here is there a sentinel base around here before we land ah it's there right it'll ask me nicely to get this um Star Trek mobile game offered a sponsorship and it actually kind of looks fun. Ooh, which Star Trek one? Is it the Lower Decks one? Because I've been looking at playing that. Maybe I can get you to come play too. If it's the Lower Deck one, that actually kind of looks kind of cool. Hmm. Right, here we go. get rid of the pillars. If I can get rid of the pillars, hopefully my sentinel can pull some of the uh, aggro. Please pull the aggro, please pull the aggro, please pull the aggro. Not good. Okay, that is going to get used, uh, something to get used to. I saw a blue sentinel, I was like, that's not mine. Took two shots and realised it was mine. We need to get rid of those repairers. Terminal's now open. Go, 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 go. Uh, boundary node exposed. Once again, I find myself in the Sentinel Glassy Archives. Once again, I am uh, passive to face the hostile interference. Laylapse has requested a total severance. I will make it so. Perform the network severance. Severance packet, broadcast, remote response confirmed. Anthony has been erased! Wow! The sentinel serves itself complete from the highest line. I see flashes of light, images of a world where everything is grassy and I finally understand. This is my fate. The ine uh, in inevitability after. It's just an archive. A complete uh, completing of data. 
pillar control nodes operational bounty node archive security rogue imposter purge from archives out of interest while I'm here do you have any other things I can steal Oh, B-class gun. Do I have a multi-tool I can swap that with? Actually, no, because I've most of my stuff for A-class or above. I don't think I've got anything. Let's shut all the sentinels down the system. That's cool. Right, Sentinels have now been disabled. Uh, let's chat to you, buddy. Do you... Do you have a... What's, what's the story? This is not Hive to be a Destiny anymore. Telmon, not Telmon. It does not have to be this end. It won't be. Uh, we've died once. We won't die again. We will have so much fun we will save the world our chance of failure is practical none agree I knew we would we have all done so well uh, we are a good team you and I do you go in my pet slot I'm wondering because that'd be amazing if you did no Double check my logs. Has that finished that quest line? That indeed would seem to be the last of the Sentinel quests line. So what a way to end the stream. Uh, we will most likely quickly end the stream and then start it back up with the next episode. So thank you so much for joining me on this one. And uh, it's been great getting the Sentinels. And uh, for those of you watching on Twitch, I'll be ending the stream and starting it straight back up again. Hello Serenity, hope you're doing well. And for you on YouTube, I hope you've enjoyed this. Remember to hit that bell and ring that like button or ring that like button and hit that. One of those. I always suck at remembering these things. But this has been Hobbs Against the Sentinels. So next one, we'll see what we do next. I'd like to try and start that egg off. But we will uh, see how it goes. Anyway. You guys all take care, and uh, hope to catch you in a bit. He pauses as he tries to open up OBS. Right, you guys take care. Bye.